how different do you believe your NBA career would have been and your life in general had you not gotten the diagnosis in 1991? Because how many more years do you feel you oh. could have played at the top of your game? Oh, right? man, I, I probably, man, I would have played a lot more years and I probably would have had been number one in assists. Right. Right? You said that um, record out there and nobody ever Oh, for sure. For sure. <laughs> for sure. And so, and we probably would have won a, a few more championships right. as well. But, you know, the, I, one thing I'm good at is dealing with the cars I'm dealt. Right. And uh, I never look back. I never been this dude that... You never asked the question like that. Why me? I, how did this happen? No. Why this? Well, I did when it first... When it first happened. When it first happened. You're like, damn. Because I remember, I remember Magic. It was in 91, and we was coming out the practice field. Yeah. And I, one of our reporters like, Magic Johnson is retiring, and he was retiring because of this. I'm like, huh, what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it was so sudden. Yes, exactly. And that's what happened. Uh, it hit me the same way. It was so right. sudden. Uh, and, man, I was sick, man, for the, for the first two years that I'm not out there right. with my guys. I'm young in you my prime. You had to be depressed. The mental, oh, the mental oh, anguish sure. of dealing with this for sure. publicly. For sure. I'm not able to play basketball. People looking at me yeah. uh, like Different. rest. And, and also the same people who used to give you the dap yeah. and the love hug. Because, they, they, because I didn't understand Magic. Okay, they say, oh, it's cool for him to play on the Dream Team, but they didn't want you in the NBA. Yeah. And yeah. All the guys. Yeah. You know, and so, especially Carl Malone, he came out publicly right. with it. Now, I just played with you. Right. In the Dream Team. In the Dream Team. I practice against you every single day. Right. And now you don't want to play with me? I mean, I'm, I'm yeah, sorry, against me? me? right. I was like, wow. You could have just said that to me. Right. You, you could have said that to me pri privately. That's right. And we'd have been, I'd have been cool with that. No question about it. So I said, you know what? I said, I don't want to, I don't want to damage the league. I don't want, if they, if they going to look at me that way, I won't come back. Right. We had some work to do. So I started educating everybody right. about the disease and everything. And then I finally came back. I played, what, half the season, a little bit. Played in 96. Mm-hmm. And I went out my way. Right. And then... They wanted me to come back, and I said, no. I think it was, 90, was it 95 96. or 96? 96, uh -huh. yeah. And I said, I'm good. Good. And so that's when I retired, and just like you and I now. Right. I'm so proud of you into your second life, and you reinvented yourself, and now you're a businessman doing great things. That's what it's all about. Right. And so that's what I decided to do, just get into my business life. You know what to do. Hit the subscribe button to become an official member of Club Shay Shay where we always do something before two something.